guys, Matt, welcome back to the shop. And we are on this month's React 2 malarkey. This is the Suzuki GS project by a channel called Doghouse Customs. Let's just get on with it. Music reminds me of um, oh, what they're called now, status quo. It's also dark, and the camera work is done by a moron. Yeah, it's not very good. Oh, it's like the lowest form of wit. <laughs> To the uh, someone's been stealing some catchphrases, methinks. Hey guys, hope everyone's had a great weekend. It's well, it's still Sunday for me while I'm filming this, but by the time it goes out, the, the weekend will probably be over. So, so I no bugger, which is fair enough, you know, we can't all be young forever. Been sat here for quite That's a while. Several cups of teas. And thinking this eel plate through. Uh, I think I'm going to go sort of a really simple route with Dude, this. I mean, the one thing I can see straight away that's wrong is that those are terrible welds. But number two is it, it's, it's too much... I don't know how you say the opposite of it, but it's it's not black enough. Because there's quite a lot going on here anyway. You know, oh, bear in mind that's loose, I haven't tied that up. <laughs> it's already... And he says there's quite a lot going on, it's not a fucking rave. Resting in place with cable ties and Again, things. Shit. So, like I was saying, there's quite a lot going on in that area anyway. So I'm going to keep it really, really simple. Keep it simple, stupid. I don't think... This is, you know, this is the problem. People don't have the vision to do something more... Uh, adventurous, you know what I mean? You can't just... You know, what we've got here, we've got a swing arm, an engine, some carbs, everything's clean. Um... It looks like it's in a mock-up stage. Yeah, the lines are well. The lines are straight. It's, it needs that nuance of wibbly wobbly and stuff like that. Um, there's a rubber bung that actually goes over this nut for the swing arm pivot point. So I think I'm just going to replace that. The frame, I believe, is all going to be black anyway. There we anyway. go. Now we're getting somewhere. You know, at the end of the day, there is no other choice. You've got... It's like what, you know, Henry Ford said, basically. So that will sort of bury that area with it all being black. Go. Again, the, I, I'm warming up to this guy because, you know, that's basically... Some of the best advice that you'll ever hear on YouTube is the fact is that you need to bury stuff, cable tie, bury stuff, and black is your only fucking look at this white and blue. It's just like you're gonna have to change that shit. So I think for the I don't plate, like all these welds though. It looks like well, I assume they're welded because the the they've all been you know they've all been linished back and hidden. Which is deceptive, you know what I mean? So I'm already... I was liking this guy, but now I'm starting to think that maybe he's just full of shit. I'm just going to come off these two fixings here with a really, really simple design. You've got to bear in mind as well, we've got the link pipe for the exhaust coming up in this area as well. So there is quite a lot you just going want to on do there. A three into one, right? That's without messing around with link pipes and shit like that. Three into one, like that. It's this the way to go. So, I think 
to make something too big with the eel plate will start to look a bit too much. Less is more and all that sort of business. Yeah, like business. a dinner tray kind of thing. You know, that is as, as less as you can get. So I think that's the route I'm going to take. Plus the other side, there's obviously not half as much going on on that side. And to do a simple eel plate over there as well, will sort of balance no, it out a bit better. Now. One thing I've noticed actually is that it's very static is this. He's going for the oldie worldy look, as in he's poor and you know he hasn't got any money and he's on the brink of despair. What he really needs, really, is you know it, I can you can tell by you can tell by the build of this guy and the fact that he looks knackered is that he's the guy who does the work. What he needs is replace a lot of this shitty wood and stuff with chipboard. The next thing he needs is he needs to get himself a presenter, someone who's a bit more approachable than he is. Uh, his accent's ruining this because he sounds like he's you know, he can't even fucking read, and he also needs a cameraman. I think, <laughs> I think that's the route I'm going to take. So I think armed with a bit of cardboard paper. and a little paper. <laughs> Again, fucking brilliant pause. Look at him; he looks like a buffoon. Um, paper's what you need, not cardboard. A bit of imagination. No, you need you need. Um, an imagination barrier that's what you need to protect yourself from crazy ideas we'll get something really really simple done have you noticed how he's talking a lot Let's... about simple and stuff simple minds simple you know simple parts simple mods this that and the other um you need to step away from restoring things and stuff and you need to really hammer on with the modifications and the fabrication is the way to go so hopefully you know, it, this moves on because this is boring as fuck. You, you know, it's like he hasn't got it on his lift yet. We haven't seen the lift shot. We haven't seen any kind of vice moving shot. We haven't seen any toolbox, tool grabs or anything like that. So we're already, what, 2 minutes 37 in and we haven't even fucking done anything. Give it a go. Right. We've got the old centres measured whoa, whoa, out. Whoa, 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 Where did this pen come from? And the hammer. Well, we've got a pen, hammer. We've got a key. We've got a pair of scissors. We've got a ruler. Don't know what the fuck that's for. I can see an orbital sander there. Where did all this come from? The sheet metal. I can see a, a bit of, what is that? One mil, one and a half mil. I can see that there. I can also see a master cylinder for a rear brake. But where did all these things come from? They can't just... It's like a, 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 on a surface plate as well. It's like a story, right? You can't just magic shit out of nowhere. I'm marked up. Armed with a rusty old washer. Rusty. And a biro. Straight away. It's fucked. We'll see what we can achieve. Hopefully. And he got manicured hands. Fucking okay, no. hell. Won't uh, have too many versions of this. <laughs> see, see, he's laughing to himself, but again, too many versions. It's quite simple. You just have an idea, you draw it on, you redraw it as you go. You do it as you go, you don't fucking plan anything out. It's just. dickhead. Fingers crossed, everybody. You see, the fingers crossed. You don't cross your fingers, it's wish me luck. Amateur. I'll make these lines too long to start with. Like I say, I'm going to try and keep it as simple this as possible. This is the possible. wrong way to go. Complexity without a plan, winging it as you go, is, is a tried and tested method. No one, think about it, right? No one got to the moon or no one learned how to fly faster than the sound barrier by any kind of measuring, planning, investigation, research or anything. They just fucking went for it because they had the balls. You know, perhaps it doesn't need anything there, but, but we'll do something. That's just gibberish nonsense. It's not much confidence. We can't see him in front of the camera. Um, you know, he's not 
tapping things and he's again I hope we get a lift shot and then maybe we'll sort of put some folds in certain places to add a bit of shape to it folds as well folds and shape it, it, this isn't making any sense I also hope that he's he, we'll, we'll see we'll see his skill level but he should you know do the scoring and stuff probably that's what that, that long thing that ruler thing's for So as we go along, we'll probably sort of trim and change things. It's just, ooh, I don't think it's got to be All too big. All this thinking and planning and it's just, this isn't entertaining, right? We want visuals. This is fucking boring. Not necessarily probably a, the old plate as such, but just a shield round this to stop your trousers sort of rubbing through the That's coating on this. That's basically what it's more for, I think. There you go, confirmation. Switch on your brain. <laughs> Maybe not. Perhaps have a go. Go with that to start with. We can maybe do a fold. Just so that top bit just kicks around a tiny bit. Let's cut that out. Transfer it onto the alloy sheet. And go from there. Right, I've done a bit of messing about. I went from the first shape. Templates, waste of time. And it's alloy, I didn't notice. To the second shape. I think you'll find it's mistaken actually... that it's steel happy with the second shape let's see how this goes so I've done a rough outline on that we'll cut see how his out. lack of control of the material when he lent on it then and he's, it tipped um, it, it's like a, a sure fire a sure fire sign that he, he doesn't know what the fuck he's doing and uh, but yeah, basically carry on from there and see where we end up. Oh. Right. I've, I've got uh, the main shape cut out. I've just got a bit of trimming to do. dickhead. Trimmage. And he's drilled the holes off camera. We don't know where that drill came from. He's got a file there. We don't know where that came from. And he's made it, he's made it fucking... It, more difficult for himself by drilling the hole. Why would you drill the holes first? That's we, we need to see these processes. We haven't, these fucking holes just magically appeared. What is this fucking Middle Earth? What the fuck is that? Nail file. Just... That's what it is. No, after, like I said, his fucking hands are manicured. Straighten a few things up a bit. And then... I think we'll attempt to add a bit of shape into this thing. No. Wish me luck. Fuck's sake. <laughs> what the fuck is that? That looks like a glove. Like a thick unwieldy, non-latex type glove with no holes in it. This is amateur, it's just amateur at best, isn't it? And we can see his tripod for his camera, which is just, from a, like I was saying, he, he really needs a cameraman and some kind of presenter to, one, direct him in the right way, two, to bounce off to give it that classic comedy element, um... And three, because his camera shots are fucking shocking. So any kind of radius or radii is made up of loads of faceted angles that are really, well, not even. You know what I mean? Doing a continuous curve like that, that's actually the, the edge is square to the, 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 the flat surfaces. Well, it's just shit in it. It just looks. It looks. It looks like some a machine did it, and we don't want that. We want the. 
I'm just braying it together out of bits I found off the scrap in the dark with no arms or legs using my teeth to control an unwieldy metal-eating badger. That's what we're looking for. We're not looking for a machine look like it was mass manufactured or anything. Factory, if you will. Oh no, so sorry, sorry. I made a mistake then. No, we want it factory. You know that hammered, fucking broken look. Broken, repaired, badly repaired look. That's what we're looking for. That's what custom DIY stuff looks like. Destroy it yourself. Oh, fucking get on with it. Finessing and trying to get things square, straight, parallel, perpendicular. It's just a waste of time. At the end of the day, as long as the engine ticks over semi-decently and it hasn't fallen off in the first six minutes, then you're all good to go. This is just procrastinating, arse-licking, fucking self-indulgent wank. God's sake. Oh, advert. Choose oh. your next adventure oh. with Nui. Some weird, horrible looking ice cream. Oh! Fuck oh, off. It's a weird looking fucking guy, that on it. Right, I've dressed that up a bit more. I know it's only small, but. Uh... <laughs> it's only small, look. You know, we are all given what we're given, and there's nothing you can do about it unless you go to Germany with about 15 grand. I think it'll be all right. Now I'm going to put a tiny bit of shape in it. I was going to do some cutouts, but I think it's a bit small. So I'm thinking putting a bit of shape into it. He hasn't explained what he meant by shape. We've also had other tools that have now come and gone, and we don't know where they come from. I don't know where the toolbox is. We're six minutes in and I haven't even seen this bike lift yet. I'll make it a bit more interesting. No, just no. Just flat, bent edges and shit welding. Yeah, let's give it a go. The Start fuck is that? Pulling this tab round. By hand? It, with with no gloves, with no latex gloves. <laughs> it's gonna shit. Fucking amateur. Go a bit bigger on that. I see. So there's the fuck up, and now we're trying to quickly behind the scenes sort it out. Again, for those who don't know, nylon-faced hammer, that's a steel ball-peen hammer. No, 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 no. You're going to fuck it doing that. It's aluminium, for God's sake. You hear that resonance, right? That's what's going to give you a white finger. That's just shockingly bad, isn't it? You see how that basically is it's a mandrel. Basically, it's just moving because he hasn't clamped it down. Ah, no, probably because we didn't see the vice go up on the bench, so I have no idea if that's even a real vice. It could be a fucking chocolate one for all we know. It's it's attention to detail that gets on my tits. Trying to make sure that you don't damage them two rings that are to catch the actual bolt holes for the for the master cylinder is just stop wasting your time just fucking clout it one for god's sake i'm also going to do a very slight fold in it just to change its shape no you don't want to use tools that are meant for the fucking job angle grinder it's simple anyone can do it you just grind the back of it so you're cutting into it a score and then you stick it and you've got a vice. I don't know if he's got a nylon hammer, but you've got a vice, you're halfway there. And just belt it round with it randomly until it moves. So 
See, it's moving all over the place. Look, look, his vice is fucking not secure. I fucking knew it. You can just tell. I think that'll be enough. We'll give it a try. I'm just going to get a brush up what? on the Scotch Bright Wheel now. And then we'll give it a try. There we you go. You see that that's simple and shit. And the cameraman, I told you, without the cameraman, these shots, and there's rust all over it, look, and dressed welds, it's like, fuck off. i say, just a simple job, really. I don't know, it's only a quick video, but uh, it's Sunday, I was actually just... Don't tell us about your life but... issues, man, for fuck's sake, there are people out there who are dying. A little bit of summer is better than nothing. So we'll just get a, a nice bit of pipe now up to that little short piece and obviously we're going to have the braided line come out and it'll be on show come out and then down to the caliper what? then up the back here probably get following the line of that actually the link pipe we'll see why would you out. no rope there's loads of, there's no rope on it it's not black i can't Without these things being black, I can't envisage what he's trying to do. It just looks like shit. We've got that little bit that wraps around the front here. So I'll get that uh, get that all welded up, or well, tacked on for now, and I'll weld it properly when the the bike comes comes to bits. What? No, you the bikes. <laughs> I don't know how to explain this. You take stuff off, you do the video, you weld the bits on, you race and do it, and then you stick it back on, and it should take you eight hours. Everyone fucking knows this. Actually, that's a lie. It's increments of four hours on then four hours being eight again. It, it, you can only do things in increments of four hours, otherwise it's not even fucking possible. That's just shit, isn't it? Too simple, not black enough. Go. It's something else done. Something else ticked off. Ah, list. now I've heard that f f fucking saying from a very wise and well-respected custom bike man. You, I won't say manufacturer, he's more like an artist. He says it's another one ticked off the list. So again, we're just nicking fucking phrases off other people here. So there we go. Like I say, it's only a quick video, but it's it's better than nothing. I'm, I'm just trying to cover I everything. Think it's that better we're doing. off without it. It's not black. I can't see any bruising from any hammer marks. It lines up. The holes aren't elongated. This is just fucking rubbish. And he said it's a quick video. How long did this take you? Fucking twenty minutes. Wrong. Straight away. Tools appear out of nowhere. Haven't seen a lift. Haven't seen a fucking toolbox. Haven't seen a linisher. Didn't don't even believe that vice is even fucking real. Best as I can. Um, I think obviously Dan's stuff is still at the powder coaters. We don't care about your fucking um, boyfriends. Why does he? Why? Why does he think we even believe? The the ego is just a fucking amazing. Probably gonna get that back mid. Again, I'm not sure. But while I'm waiting for that, I am just going to plow on with this. Uh, put Just plow the hours in. And, eight hour uh, increments. At least he's, he's redeemed himself ever so slightly. He just didn't consider the word eight. said before, try and get it so when Dan's is coming back, this is virtually ready to go. Don't for care. Coating. Uh, the, that's going to feel a lot better, ticking some massive jobs off the list. Than there we go, ticking off the list again, just robbing phrases. You can't just go after people who've been on YouTube for fucking ages and just start lifting their stuff and fucking stealing their phrases and all that shite. You just can't do it. All built back up with paint and powder. All what? Done. Oh, sorry, when he said powder. Right, so powder coating is a complete waste of time, right? There's this paint called Simone's... Uh, um, oh, I always forget. Tough black. It, you don't need any primer, don't need any prep, don't need to clean anything, don't need to dress welds. 
You don't need to fucking even weld properly. You don't need to remove any greases or brake fluid or fucking bodge jobs, fill the dust, um, anything shit like that. You don't need to worry about it. You just spray, even dirt, right? You can spray tough black over dirt. It's that fucking amazing. That's what but you yeah. need instead of this powder shit. Well, say, just a quick one, but it, it's something else done. Anyway, it's actually nearly seven o'clock in the evening, so I'm going to That's not fucking long that. enough. That's nowhere near eight hours. It's seven. You've just said seven. Cheers for watching, guys. Take care. Well, I don't know what I could say about that. I think I've said it all. Another fucking shit video off YouTube. Hope that makes sense, and I'll see you in a bit.